Pink Wig event started back in 2009 when our friend and founder Sally Hicks Wood was diagnosed with breast cancer and for a bit of a laugh we all decided to go out one night to put a pink wig on to wish her well within her cancer journey um, and people were trying to give us money as we were going through the pubs uh, and we weren't collecting that year so we had to say no so it sparked something in Sally to say do you know what perhaps at the end of my cancer treatment could we all get together, perhaps a few more of us, uh, I'll contact a national breast care charity and we'll see if we can actually um, donate to them the money that we've raised. So that's kind of how we've started and how we've evolved. So that year there was about 100 of us. Um, and then the following year there was 250 women doing exactly the same thing, doing the pubs through Falmouth, but actually it was too big for the pubs in Falmouth by that time. So then we contacted um, Tim Vigas of um, Falmouth Week, who organises all the Shoreside events, square um, happenings down there. And um, we actually asked him, could we be a part of this? And he said, yes, we could. So um, then we have started to, to kick off Falmouth Week. Um, and this is our fifth year now of kicking off Falmouth Week. Um, and in the years that we've been going, we've raised £75,000 for our chosen charities. Uh, we donate to breast cancer now because actually they do do a lot of research into breast cancer and breast cancer treatments and we feel that this is important for our future generations and it was important to our founder that research was carried out in the hope that we have a safer tomorrow. Um, but we also felt it was really important supporting our local breast care team. So that's why we have chosen also to support the Cornwall breast care team.